first plus basically you see the first of all i mean basic things as your quality is going to come from the field your raw material has to be really good you have to pluck even good leaf of even size which we call two leaf and bud i mean it should not be overgrown it should not be undergrown sort of things uh, once it is transported for initial say uh, 10 to 12 hours it is being uh, dried up to great extent the moisture is removed say in tune of somewhere 62 63 percent by mostly with the ambient air maybe the sometimes if you find some of the leaves is quite leathery or a lot of moisture then lukewarm air also is being given but this period of withering goes for 10 to 12 hours we we got around 22 traps for that this takes the withering takes maximum space because space is very important in any industrial setup that takes your maximum because you have to give a very thin spray at all so once you achieve this uh, desired degree of work with a say in tune of somewhere 62 63 thereafter it is taken to next process which we call rolling we got it two types of roller you have seen actually with the diameter of table it is being set 36 inches and 46 inches roller so the leaf is fed directly through the hopper and the, the machine and that, that uh, roller keeps on moving there are certain rpm you fix always is uh, uh, slow rpm is always give better roll it, you should not go in very vigorously and all those so in tune of some 30 to 32 rpm uh, we just keep adjust to this one and uh, that table is a actually asymmetric well is designed in such a way and it is covered on the top there is a cover so that cover is in a circular barrel and uh, the leaf gets just all this uh, circular and um, up and down motion inside that and that the tables the cones battens in some cases people use or this contour gives it I mean we used to this so normally it goes in a centric motion it goes in a circular motion so initially for say 10 15 minutes this sort of conditioning we don't give any pressure so we just move with this then we see that a little bit of the juices has come out it has been oozed out gone and the leaf surface becomes more I mean flaccid and rubbery look thereafter gradually you put some pressure also the pressure sequence all depends on the type of leaf degree of there are all so many parameters so uh, on the top there is a pressure plate and as per your de desire you can give just a pressure but the mostly that pressure period is very small because we have to give the pressure to take out but too much of things will immediately spoil the tea so it's hardly for two minutes three minutes maximum of the five minutes then you'll see in between we are just taking out seeing that what the twist you got or not and how the i mean the flavor things are developing and all so we inhale the leaf take the smell and all and then once we understand that things are okay then it's being discharged with you can just open that uh, uh, table down below uh, there's an opening slit and then it is carried to the table uh, fermentation table there we just spread very thinly and we see that maximum oxidation or you can say whatever you desire the oxidation has taken place after that it is taken to the dryer that's all we use the Britannia dare is one of the best for making our actually this darling tea so it's a six feet dryer it travels in cones and battens it has got a perforated trees and from the top you feel it it is in a three circuit sort of thing and you can fix up the travel time for this say maybe 20 minutes 21 minutes 22 minutes and uh, from uh, uh, furnace side there is a metallic tube uh, and there is a big arch where the coal is burnt and the temperature normally say 118 to 120 degree uh, centigrade we are using right now and once from the top we feed it say in 21 22 minutes as it comes down it gets maximum it's a very gradual dry on the top is a least temperature then little more then little more it's like a simple cooking of the food finally it is fully dry and then fully dried level we allot around 2.5 to 3 percent of moisture which is actually the recommended this one so your manufacturing almost is finished then it goes for a grading and sorting sections where i mean basically on a four grade steam we make it's a full size leaf then it's a broken it's a, it's a smaller size of the leaf or it's a broken part of it then there is a even a smaller than which is called as a fanny 
and the last one is the finest is the dust so so in the most of the sorting section you might have seen it's all on a volume and size based on that uh, different sizes are I mean just uh, uh, separated and then of uniform size and then taste it marking packing all those things goes so this is a nut cell very quickly I've done और तो चिया लाया था नहीं, तेज वाले बनाओ ना पोर्ट में, अब ना पानी दे।